Hi there, South Florida. Good Monday morning. Tracking the tropics, we're watching three areas, but they are not posing a threat to South Florida. So we'll start off with real time Doppler of what's happening right now this Monday morning. It is quiet, just a light drizzle here and there. Otherwise, we're going to keep things quiet until we hit the afternoon hours. That's when we have a good chance for maybe an inland thunderstorm by around 115. This model showing that there could be a thunderstorm, maybe over coral springs by then if not uh, most of South Florida, we're looking dry, a little more sunshine today as well. So that will eventually lead to more thunderstorms through the afternoon and evenings, but mainly over the Everglades this afternoon. Also, it is nice and quiet out there. Look at the water, the surf, almost calm out there. It looks like one foot out there or less than that. And then lots of cloud cover this morning, but we'll see more sunshine throughout today as uh, we are expecting less cloud cover compared to yesterday. Yesterday was very cloudy. Temperatures right now running in the lower 80s. A warm spot is Key West at 83 degrees and over Miami. We're also dealing with cloud cover. So sun and clouds for today and this afternoon, late in the afternoon, those thunderstorms will remain inland, mainly over the Everglades. Temperature is getting near 90 degrees for the high, but the feels like we'll get close to triple digits. Now let's talk about the tropics. We have three areas, Fred, Grace and eight tropical depression eight, which is very close to Bermuda. Let's uh, also talk about Fred first because Fred is expected to make landfall late this afternoon or early evening hours as a tropical storm right now maximum sustained winds at 15 miles per hour there are already heavy rain bands moving through parts of the panhandle uh, so panama city beach that area even tallahassee will get some rain due to fred fred will continue to move on northward and eventually becoming a remnant low tropical depression grace is just to the south of dominican republic later tonight and overnight hours moving over southern haiti still as a tropical depression, but you'll note here on the cone by tomorrow afternoon could upgrade to a tropical storm. The thinking is that the center will remain over the water between Cuba and Jamaica, and so that will help Grace to get a little more organized and strengthen a bit, but because of wind shear should stay as a tropical storm as it impacts the Yucatan Peninsula and eventually headed towards the western Gulf of Mexico. And then there's tropical depression. A could become the next named storm as early as today, if not by tomorrow. That next name starts with an H, but it's not Henry. It's spelled like that. You'll see that. Uh, you'll see what I'm talking about, but it's actually pronounced Henry. And as far as Tropical Depression 8, it is expected to stay over the open waters, loop around Bermuda, but Bermuda will still get those tropical storm force winds, and so there's a tropical storm watch in effect.